This is my first Vidini coil. I ran it for about 20 minutes and it charged the capacitor to about 45 volts. There's the capacitor. Now, here's the Bedini coil. The trigger is manual. I didn't put magnets. It was by hand. I would strike the battery and it would charge the capacitor. It's solid state. Very few parts. Here's the circuit diagram. Very simple. But I noticed something very strange. When I unhook the power, right here, the power's off. No power. The coil is charging the capacitor from the ambient magnetic fields that are around the coil. Coil. Capacitor. Power transistor. There's the power transistor. Trigger, which I do by hand. Now, watch. I'll discharge the capacitor. Now, there's no power in the circuit at all. Zero. And the capacitor is charging right now with zero power applied to this coil. The capacitor is charging itself from the ambient magnetic fields of this coil. There is no power applied to this circuit at all. And I'll short the capacitor again. Zero. And here it comes again. There is no power. I don't know if you can see here. There's just power cables from the multimeter going to the circuit to measure it. There's no power anywhere attached to this unit. It's totally to itself. Here's the power cables. They're not connected to anything at all. And the meter is rising with no power applied. Zero. I'll give it a few more seconds so you can see the power rising. It's very slow. But all of this power, so the battery is disconnected. Only one pole is connected. There's no current flow. And the power is rising in the capacitor. This is my first Bedini coil. And I'm going to build some big ones.